What's going on guys? My name is Jake Adams. I'm a reporter with Reef Builders and um, I'm a super huge fan of the Kessel brand of lighting. I still remember the first time I ever saw a Kessel light and I was absolutely floored. You know, I started experimenting with aquarium LED lights um, using spotlights, you know, small screw-in uh, PAR 38s and PAR different sizes. And Kessel was the one company that came along and just really showed us what was possible in a spotlight form factor. And so over the years, they've introduced different sizes, different colors, especially that tuna blue spectrum that just makes it super easy to dial in uh, all the color that you want, but also maintaining an intensity that is safe for your corals. And it's still the only company that has carved this path in the spotlight form factor. So although the Kessel lights have been around for a long time, today, even today, I would still be totally fine using the previous generation of Kessel LED spotlights. But knowing that there's a completely new line of LED spotlights, the X series, the 360X, I'm just so excited to see how all the different little technical features that they've introduced and trickled out are gonna apply to this light. It's gonna be such a powerhouse lighting platform. One of the biggest changes to the Kessel X series line of lights and controls is a digital control. So before it was a simple one to 10 volt control that could control a couple channels. But now they actually use a form of USB-C link that they call the K-Link system that's gonna allow even more granular uh, adjustments and programming of different lights, of different groups, of different aquarium zones, and it's gonna be simply, simply amazing. This light delivers every possible feature that we could have ever hoped for in an aquarium light, especially the castle lights. It's smaller, it's brighter, it's got that lower profile. Now it's gonna have even more colors and color channels. Man, I'm just getting a look at it at here at MACNA, and I just can't wait to test it for myself. 